Are you excited about the Super Bowl? Are you a football fan? I'm kind of a football fan. You know what? I was, I was excited to see last week Ellie Kemper hosting this show. Oh, yes. She did such a good job. She I was did. watching it backstage. Yeah, she did a great job. She was unreal. She, you know, poor girl. We threw her into it, and she had to learn the whole thing in a couple of hours. So She was unbelievable. Yeah. Yeah, yeah it was really nice to see. Um, yeah. No, I don't have any stake in the Super Bowl. I'm a Giants fan. Oh, that didn't happen. Yes, that, yep. well, kind of. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> so, so, you don't, so you don't care who wins? I, I, I guess via brother, uh, I want Peyton yeah. and, and the Broncos. Yeah. That's yeah. probably half of the crowd. I guess the other yeah. half is Seattle, yeah. maybe. And a third don't care at all. <laughs> I love Seattle, and you know, I, I really do. I, I, I was hoping for the Saints myself, and then the uh -huh. Packers, and then that didn't happen. So I really didn't care until Zane Beatles from the Broncos came on the show and uh, professed his love for me, and so of course I, I am now for them. Well, now I'm f now I'm all in. Good, you're for the Broncos. Yeah, of course. And so is Mario. Mario. Mar Mario also thinks the Broncos will win in with uh, two or three points. You're throwing out a line? No, no, she did a whole Jedi mind trick. Don't pay attention. No. <laughs> <laughs> I did not. I did not. Uh, is your wife a fan? This is the one time of year I think she gets into football. Oh, really? She, yeah, because it's like a party. Yes. You know, it, and she likes, she likes the party. It is. And, and will you, who doesn't like to no. party? Yeah, she apologizes some, for, uh, for it sometimes. For so, partying? Yeah, sometimes we'll be at dinner and she's like having a couple cocktails and she gets a little loud and she'll go, oh, sorry, I like to party. <laughs> I'll be like, honey, take, keep it down. Ugh. Sorry, I like the part, and then she'll just go back in. How long have y'all been married? Oh God, so long. Um, <laughs> five years now. Five years is yeah. not a long but, time. No, but we've been together for <laughs> 11. Oh. They applaud because in Hollywood, that is a long time. That is. Look at that. Yeah. And, uh, and you, you and your wife have a beautiful little child who the last time you were here, you were guest DJing, and yes. you told me that she was obsessed with Katy Perry's song, Roar. Yeah, she got real into Roar. And, what, and is she still into Roar? It went from, well, it went from like these nursery rhymes and kind of, you know, like Itsy Bitsy Spider to Roar. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I thought, well, this is a transition. Uh, but now that's opened the door to all pop music, and the, pro the problem becomes is she starts singing these songs that she, she doesn't know the words, that, you know, like blurred lines <laughs> will come on the radio. All of a sudden, she knows uh, all the, the the words to this song, and uh, and she's going, "You know, you want it. You know, you want it." You know, I'm like, "You, I'm like, you, you don't want, you don't want it at all. <laughs> you don't know what it is. <laughs> I quite frankly hope you never know what it is." <laughs> Especially in the scenario with, oh. uh, goodness gracious, that oh. song. Yeah, that's scary for, to hear your daughter sing that, but it's adorable at the She's same so time. She's so happy, too, in the back seat of the car. You know, you want, I'm like, oh, please, you've got to stop. How old is she? She's four. She's, but that's adorable, though, kind of. It's kind of the best. You're yeah. like, at the, at, at, at the same point, you're kind of, you're like, please don't sing that, but I also kind of want to film yeah, it. Yeah, of course. You want to put that up. That's, yeah, that's, that's right. really cute. Hey, before uh, we run out of time, we have to talk about the fact that Prince was on your show. Look at that. Prince was on New Girl. <laughs> you a Prince fan? I'm a huge Prince fan. It was one of the most surreal experiences of my life. Um, there was a scenario during the show where we, we, he's singing on stage, and the gang joins him on stage, and we dance. we dance with Prince. And he kind of moves off to the side, kind of like where Mario would be behind the uh, DJ booth. And I noticed that I was up against the DJ booth right next to him, and I'm dancing, and his song's on, and I'd completely forgotten about the show or the character or acting at all. And I was like, I'm just feeling this, and I'm dancing. And I kind of looked over at him, and he gave me a look like, hey, man, I'm, I'm, like, I'm, I'm kind of proud of you, kind of thing. <laughs> but I also realized like, what he was looking at was a 13-year-old at, at his bar mitzvah, maybe? <laughs> and I didn't want that to be the reality in this. You know, I wanted to be like, hey, me and Prince are on the same level. We're right. just, and I could see like that wasn't happening, but he was, he was happy that I let loose, that I was free in that moment. That's very cool. Yeah, it was the, the, that, it was the coolest. That's like gonna open it up to all kinds of people that are gonna come do the show now, once Prince does it. <laughs> Let's hope. Yeah. <laughs> are you available? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, no, but I'll send Ellie Kemper, because she can... Yeah, that's right. <laughs> she does my work now. Um.